Welcome, Clashers, to another exciting episode of Clash of Clans Attacks. I am your host, Galadon, and yes, today is another Let's Play episode bringing the heat in Clan Wars at Town Hall 8. We are talking about fire from the skies, dragons, and balloons. Now, again, this is a Let's Play episode, so it's sponsored by Feature Points, so if you get a chance, please do check them out. The link is in the description. It is not only a great way to earn free apps, free gems in Clash of Clans, but you also support the channel. But we're going to get right into the attack here. You can see young Gal from LP6 Talos is attacking Darkness 444 from full attack with not just dragons but balloons as well. And this is an anti-dragon base setup with the air defenses in the dead center and that ring of double walls with that little gap that is designed to force those units to go around but a great use of balloons to get into those defenses in the center a good placement of spells right in the dead center although we do have some overlap there uh, they are getting those air defenses down and that is pretty much the key to victory in this attack with the last air defense down you see there's about a half a dozen dragons that remain and there is just almost no chance that this base can stop all of those dragons even a maxed out wizard tower maxed out teslas for town all eight are not going to do a lot of damage slowing down these dragons once those air defenses are in the past there is nothing stopping a three-star victory except for usually time. And in this case, Young Gab has plenty of time. Here goes the very last structures wrapping up a three-star victory for LP6 Talos. So you can see there that even a well-designed anti-dragon base is not going to stop a well-executed attack of dragons and or dragons and balloons. And now we've got Chasta, also from LP6 Talos, also moving in with a hybrid attack of dragons and balloons. And they do work best when deployed together so those balloons can work in support of the dragons. Notice the dragons getting some of those mines and bombs out of the way. Here come balloons out of the clan castle and they're going to head straight for that archer tower and of course the air defense. That being the design of this attack, take out air defenses early. The balloons are going to get to one. The lightning spells got to the second and you'll notice at the top right of your screen the other set of balloons have headed towards the last air defense. They're just about to finish it off. There it is. And now that spells doom for Emerald of full attack. You've got one lonely clan castle dragon doing its best, but it is quickly going to be burned to the ground. And now the remaining dragons, plenty of health, a flank movement from the right, flank from the far left, three down the center in perfect coordination will just wipe their way through the rest of this village and complete a perfect three-star war attack for Chasta and LP6 Talos. But Talos members weren't the only ones raining terror from the skies in this clan war. We had our own crispy panda of full attack come in with a full mass dragon raid against this pretty well upgraded Town Hall 8. You see those air defenses, uh, two of them off towards the left, and that is definitely the downfall of this base design. You can see a good deployment of the dragons, a few on the left, a few on the right, and a big pack right in the center headed for those air defenses. A rage spell goes down, and they move in a second rage spell right over all of the clan castle troops, and there the dragons go, clan castle troops down, both of those air defenses go down in a heartbeat, and now this base is in a world of hurt. You've got easily eight dragons still up and only one air defense left. All the spells have been used, but it doesn't matter. There are just so many dragons headed towards that air defense. Nothing is going to stop them, and sure enough, all three focus on the air defense, wipe it out, and again, it just becomes a matter of a race against the clock, but there is more than enough time left for the Crispy Panda to complete this three-star attack. Dragon working their way through every last structure, knocking them all down, even getting a chance to go out to the corners, take out those last builder's huts, and a uh, sneakily placed Tesla. So that is going to wrap up this Town Hall 8 Terror from the Skies episode. But the Let's Play series has a lot more time at Town Hall 8. I'm going to work on Valkyries at some point. I'm going to level up my Hog Riders. I'm sure we have a lot more strategies. I'm curious to hear what you guys think. Please do check out the other videos from Town Hall 8. Check out Feature Points so we can keep this thing going. Like, comment, and of course, subscribe. And I will see you guys again tomorrow with more full attacks. As all the air defenses are down, the defending clan cast and dra clan clan blah, 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 got well over all. I mean, I mean, ha, 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 ha.
And watch out for the queen. She is going to be doing total damage. Ah, that's a dollar, Galidon. No. Every time you say total damage, Peter, I demand you, a dollar. You don't hold a copyright on the term. Oh, I most certainly no. do. That and you're welcome. Well, now you're just being ridiculous, Peter. You're welcome. <laughs> oh, boy.